traveling to other lands, find stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? <laughs> Let's hope Tyr's in a talkative mood after being imprisoned for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. That earthquake earlier. Do you think there will be another one? It's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Thumble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Atreus, look ahead. Wow, now this looks like a city. Welcome to Nidavellir, brothers. Hey, Tours! Oh, they're uh, running away. An alarm. Don't you send an alarm like that if I still had my body and was fearing the notion of being detached from it? Why was that for us, though? They are scared. It was definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own. Is that statue of Odin? They must really love him. Or fear him. If I hear you, uh, you think you will be spying on me, huh? Every spy. Sindri! Hello! I'd return your surprise, but I did know you'd be here. I've got something for you. Oh, what is this? Hello. Thank you. What is it, dwarf? You know, I'm glad I came back here at least once before Ragnarok. Oh, if these cobblestones could talk. Then they'd have mouths. Filthy, disgusting mouse. Do you mind if I fiddle with your bow? Oh, you are long overdue for a replacement. <sighs> Taking advantage of certain material. Ow! Structural sensitivity to sonic vibrations has been something uh, I've been meaning to try for quite some time now. Thanks for, uh, finally trying it. What's it gonna be this time? Patience! I find it's best to see these things... Oh, in action! Ah. There. Oh, take aim at that gate there. But before you loose, say, Skiaf. Well, I certainly didn't expect you to disturb half the creepy crawlers in need of Valir. How was I supposed to know they were there? Okay, so, Derlin. Sindri, any idea where the tavern is? Do I look like I've ever been to a filthy tavern? The sewer you just punched a hole through seems promising, though. For you. It should lead to the other side of the city. It's not like you're able to open other doors. Another of Kavassia's poems. 
outstanding. And I can go everywhere. More crafting components. Oh yeah, maybe this dude can uh, upgrade my, maybe I can upgrade this armor. Oh, where'd he go? Oh, he's right here. Let's see. Nothing appeals to you? Best of luck. Any outsider is considered a threat. Is that to protect the dwarves? It sounds like it. But knowing Odin, there's sure to be an ulterior motive. Well, everyone's hiding on this side, too. Odin's occupation of this realm has its hooks in deep. But there aren't any guards patrolling. We're clearly not a threat. Why hide? Resist and you're made an example of. You keep the rest in line. Self-preservation can outweigh bravery for even the strongest of folk. Fear keeps them safe and alive. The tavern's gotta be around here somewhere. Maybe well, we can try knocking there. on some doors for directions. There's gotta be a way that I can get in there. Excuse me, but we're looking Nothing for... Nothing for you here. I don't care what you want. No food, no place to work. No nothing. Leave! Hmm. Oh, I think it's a trail. A trail spoke into something over here. Mm, I don't see anything. Yeah. This looks promising, right? Well, it's like a house. If he's here, maybe you should let me do the talking. You. Well, we don't want to intimidate him. You're tall as a tree and you have a severed head on your head. <clears throat> None taken. <laughs> Point, though. Think that's him? Hello? Watch yourselves. Apparently, there are intruders about. Oh, that's us, I think. Eh, well, if you're planning on killing me, at least let me finish this song. That alarm was in just the perfect key. We're just looking for a friend of ours named Derlin. <laughs> well, we both know that's not true. Derlin's got no friends left. But if that's all you need, head out the back way there. And you'll see the safety office just across the river. Just don't go making trouble for the rest of us. And while you travel through this realm, maybe you could clean up the head's mess. What mess? Later, brother. I wish to hear of this mess. The rig's in the bay. Why don't you ask the condescending skull? Head, I've got skin. But he's right. I made a mistake. I'd have us shut them down. Well, some of Mir has been here. Sorry, one more thing. Although, these are gifts I'm giving to you, so I shouldn't be sorry and you should be thankful. Anyways, here, please be careful. It's beautiful. Thanks, Sindri. It is beautiful, isn't it? It's also very useful. You'll be able to find anything your heart desires with it. Really? As long as your heart desires the locations your father and you decide and plot to travel together, then yes. It is a compass. Ah, but a beautiful compass. Now scamper off. Press the left side of the okay. Come. A boat cannot be far. Earlier, Sindri made it sound like Derlin was some sort of rebellion leader. 
Doesn't sound like anyone's following you. Was being the key word here, little brother. Okay, I saw know. a dog back there. Maybe there's a boat we can use to get to Derwin's. Wait, I know I seen. I seen that. Uh, is it? Mr. Gay was out of the map. There's a building just past these rocks behind me. Maybe we should head that way. Ah, uh, those bloody mining rigs. What about them? The Scald is right to blame me for them. They were my idea. If you've got the time, they're in the bay just beyond this tunnel. Oh, another inch or so. I'd particularly appreciate us checking out the mining rigs in the lake to the right. You can see the smokestacks from here. But if you don't want to explore now, it looks like Derlin's place is through that open gate to the left. So, which way do we go? We could prepare more before rescuing Tyr. Up to you. Hmm. Maybe we can go this way. Namir, were you really the one who had those rigs built? Odin wanted the dwarves under his control, and well, I convinced him he could buy their allegiance instead of demanding it outright. A trade agreement of sorts. Oh, a dragon. Dragon Beach. The dragon sculpture is not bad. Oh, I heard something. Oh, look at that thing. This is the ghost. Uh, this one more. Oh no, that's not. Oh Jesus. Oh, that's the same dude. I mean, the same, whatever the hell. Oh, he thinks he's slick. Slick, huh? and love an axe. Last one. 
I heard one of these things. Oh, look at that. Hmm. Maybe through here. Oh, I know. That little guy got a lot of resources. I'll take him out of here. First time someone's told me that, I suppose. Where are the things for that thing, though? F, R, and whatever that other one is. Hmm. Oh, there it, there it is. Plus one. So did it. Dead. They are hiding those things. Let me see. One out of two? Didn't I just get one in the other round? What's in here? Taking a break before visiting Durlin? Very wise. One of the he can be. Here. See the smoke above us? That's where we're headed. Let's see if we can't shut it down. <laughs> wow. There's a lot to explore here. Kind of nice to be out of Midgard for a bit, huh? Well, I heard this fool. I know there's a bird around here. Odin's got an eye on me somewhere. Incoming! <laughs> 
Nightmares? Oh. Another one, bro. You weren't there. The rigs might be chock a block with materials that could help us. I'd grab whatever it spits up in the process. Oh, there you are. Dwarves agreed to the deal with Asgard. Why do they blame you? I talked them into their own exploitation. They made their choice. Work or die is not a choice. I only made it seem so. But what you just picked up there is pure Sparklefheim ore. It won't be of use in the ring anymore, but perhaps our Huldra brothers could craft something from it. Go! <laughs> Hmm. There's a lot of useful resources here. Well, I was there, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, there's a. Uh, a chest treasure there. What the hell? Oh, nice. So I gotta use the blaze for this one. Oh. 
there's a third one around. Oh, it's right there. Increase rage. See what is this way? still here what the island near the geyser we need to get the key from it and unlock this door we need i need to set light a very old wall Boy, didn't even flinch. Better give me some good. Oh, nice. A lot of resources. And I hear you. Oh, there you are. Look at you. Look at you. You think you're slick, huh? There's two go. Oh, there we go. Oh. What the? It disappears. Wow. Go! Go! 
Oh, he can shoot it. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Let's see. A prisoner of sorts. Is that pure startle fine slag? Give it here. to harvest ore for armaments, essentially harnessing resources that would otherwise go to the dwarves. Do you think shutting these things down will help the dwarves become independent? I don't know, but I have to try something. Well, there's a small... It was huge. Yeah, it should lead us to the key for that watchtower door. <laughs> Those mining rigs sure spit out a lot of smoke. There's another mining rig on this island, brother. Smell that smoke. Why would the dwarves agree to work for the Aesir in the first place? That's the heart of it, eh? You lied to them. I lied to them. Bet we could swing across that, uh, lift thing. Gantry. Gantry. Thanks. It's gotta be the right spot. Yeah, that looks right. <laughs> Okay, Mimir. To the blacksmiths of Svartalfheim, the creation of a weapon was a sacred thing. But Odin just wanted as many blades as he could get, as fast as he could get them. With every stolen resource or mediocre blade, the dwarves lost a bit of themselves. The 
have survived because of you. Ah, you're not wrong there, brother. Odin would have wiped out every last dwarf in Sparklefheim. If he couldn't use their skills, no one could. The last one is over here. Wait, what is that? Oh, I came from there, huh? Father, what was Spartan training like? Unforgiving. Is that why you didn't train me like one? Did you not think I could handle it? I did not think you should have had to. Thanks. Smell the smoke? There's another mining rig here. You speak of your deeds with shame. Do you regret not allowing Odin to kill them? I don't. Oh. If the dwarves didn't like working for Asgard, couldn't they just quit? And do what? Their newly built forges poisoned the soil of Svartalfheim. Unable to grow their own food, they had to buy it from Asgard. If they stopped working, they'd be taking food out of their own mouths. Oh, that's clever. And awful. That thing looks like a dog. So see to Muspelheim. Think it might lead to that combat arena we visited years ago? What makes you say that? Wishful thinking, I guess. <coughs> Going through Surtur's gauntlet, it was fun. It was training. You didn't have fun? Mm. Well, anyway, we should look for the other half of the seed. Once it's whole again, we can see where it leads. Anything illuminating? That's too far. Gotta remove something. Oh, this thing. Oh, I see. Oh, that's a big boy. They just keep coming. It's a bear trap. Spawning a little wretch is like there's no tomorrow. Behind well, will be so.
There's no war. It is done. If you could call so meager a task done, a wee drop out of the Asgardian occupational bucket. You must live with your deeds, but do not be troubled by them, brother. Oh? And why not? You were given an impossible problem. Do not blame yourself for failing to solve it. I'm sure the dwarves would feel differently. This doesn't fix things. No, but it is a start. A reminder, brother. That Spartalfheim slag we collected could be of considerable use in the hands of Brock or Sindri. The air smells a lot cleaner. It's because we shut down the rig. Now let's go see body. Atreus, you are getting better, faster. I'd even be better than you one day, huh? If you are not, I have failed. Oh. We going to Derlin? Hope he'll be happy we fixed those rigs. This is the safety office? Well, the sign of hair's breadth away from a head injury up there certainly gives that impression. We're looking for Derlin? Do you have an appointment? Uh, no? Has anyone ever had an appointment here? <laughs> Did you collect on something, pal? Think, uh, parading a severed head around on your hip is gonna scare me into somehow approving Estrid's accretion proposal, eh? We are looking for a prisoner of Odin's. <laughs> He's being kept in a mine somewhere. Some friends of ours said that you could help. Where did you get... You chop her head off with that too, eh? She was my wife. Dina and I... Wondered where she went after our little coup here failed. Failed? Yeah, come, come. Failed. Ray is dead.
Rest of them are. The ones left alive have to pay the price. I'm afraid <clears throat> I can't help you with your little prisoner situation. But he could have answers on how to stop Odin and free Svartalfheim from the Aesir. No, I'm not in the business of trusting the old father anymore. Wait, before you go. Take this. What is it? A fine. Hygiene code violation for improper transport of a rotting head. Uh, two demerits for speaking the All Father's given name, and um, yeah, for fucking up my desk. A fine. Pay it at your leisure. Okay. Get out of my office. Hey there. So what about... Get out of my office? Don't you understand? You said her name was Diener? Oh, uh, sure. Thank you. I think. Jeez, man, how many are you mother?
Jeez, too many of these fools. Okay, as I was saying, I think Zerlin wrote down directions. The dwarf has given us a map. Sort of. Uh, you smell them? But it seems to lead to a mine beyond that map. Ah, here. Zerlin helped us anyway. Not everyone uses axes and arrows to fight. Okay, so where's this door? It's right here. This thing looks like it can take us up the mountain. Maybe we'll be able to see a mine up there. Ah, nothing quite like a dwarven train ride. I can't get up there, there. Oh, that thing. We can take that train up the mountain when you're ready, brother. I think I could move that. Oh, I think I don't can I, I don't think it's possible. There's a name I don't miss hearing. No one said it until you did, just now. Darling, he didn't need to say it, brother. It was written all over his face. Uh, well, burned, I should say. Into his head. He burned that into Derlin's head? Failed rebellions tend to warrant swift and enduring retribution. He is a captain of Odin. Aye, and the bearer of Galahorn. True believer, that one. There are few things so dangerous in a man as lack of doubt. Like we're here. Come on, 